The Boston Celtics have been rumored to be going after a defensive three-point shooting big man. One of those players is, in fact, Jeremy Grant. It has been rumored that the Celtics have already offered the Pistons a couple of packages, which the Pistons have declined. So today, we will be rebuilding the Boston Celtics with Jeremy Grant on the team. Real quick before the video begins though, I know a big portion of the viewers watching this channel are not subscribed, so please just go down there, have a check to make sure you press that button. Subscribing is completely free and it helps us out so much. We post four My League videos every single day, so if you like My League, be sure to subscribe. But let's get into the rest of today's video. Alright lads, here we go with today's video. Hopefully, you guys are all having a fantastic day today. We are rebuilding the Boston Celtics while trading for Jeremy Grant. That's what I said in the intro, so let's get into it. Right, so here's a trade package that I personally think would potentially go through if I was a Pistons. I wouldn't say no. Here's the trade package. We've put together Tristan Thompson, Jeff Teague, Romeo Langford, and three first-round picks. There was an article saying that the Celtics offered multiple first-round picks for Jeremy Grant, and the Pistons still said no. So, we've given them three. They can't say no, plus Romeo Langford uh, and for Jeremy Grant and two, uh, basically, cap fillers. But here's the trade that I'm going to go through. Yes, I do have control of both teams, just to make sure that trade does go through. So, rotation for this first season is Kemba, Brown, Tatum, Grant, and Williams. Yes, I'm going to be playing Robert Williams as our starting center. He's been having a ripper season, and I think he deserves to start. Uh, and then we We've also got Marcus Smart, Daniel Tice, Peyton Pritchard, Javante Green, and Semi Ojale off of our bench. I think that's a pretty decent, solid bench. I am going to send Aaron Naismith down the G League for this first season. Hopefully, he progresses for us and we'll be our backup small forward. Uh, that way, we can get rid of Javante Green. But besides from that, there's no one else that I really want to send down into the G League. I could send him down there, I reckon. Just see if he progresses into something, I suppose. We are running a four-star balance system. It is the best fit for the team. And the Boston Celtics are the projected fourth seeds. So hopefully, hopefully we can do something this season. Otherwise, we're going to have to make some trades next season. At the All-Star break here, Jason Tatum is the only All-Star for the team. I honestly don't get 2K. We put together a really good team. Yeah, uh, we went 44 and 38. LeBron won himself MVP. Melo, Dinwiddie, Giannis, Christian Wood, and Doc Rivers all won those awards. Like, the Celtics finished as a sixth seed. Huh? Yeah, like, that would happen if this team... Put, was put together, right? Yeah, surely that would happen. JT dropped 27, 6, and 4. Don't really care. I care about Jeremy Grant's stats. 16, 5, and 2 for Jeremy Grant on two, well, basically one block a game and one turn, uh, one turn of it. That's a steal. A one steal and one block a game. Shooting about 11 shots a game on 52% shooting. Nice. Offensively, we were the fifth best team and our defense was the eighth worst. Right on, man. Right on, brother. Right on, brother. Let's get swept in the first round. Okay, let's beat the Bucks in six games then. We've now got the Nets, who've added Hassan Whiteside. Yeah, that's nice. Love that. Love that Hassan Whiteside signing, Brooklyn. Like he needed to kick our ass even more, mate. The Nets end up winning the championship and Harden wins finals MVP. So I can say with great confidence, we need a better starting center. <laughs> we need a better starting center. I think uh, the, the Boston Celtics should go after a center more than Jeremy Grant. But if they want Jeremy Grant, they can get Jeremy Grant, I suppose. Uh, Robert Williams and Grant Williams come on back to the team. Javante Green, I don't really care, mate. Don't really care. And we've got Daniel Tice and Semi Ojale as our two free agents that we should re-sign. Perfect. Demarcus Cousins, mate. If we offer you something a bit like this, right? A bit like that. And you come onto this team and then we just trade you. <laughs> and then we just go over here. Who aren't we going to use? Daniel, T I think. Because we've got Grant Williams coming through. We don't need Tice or Ojale. Actually, yeah. Before we trade Cousins, let's get rid of Ojale and Tice. See what comes up. I see myself Dario Saric. I'll take it. I'll take uh, Dario. Because Dario, if you move to the four. Holy crap, he goes up four overalls. Jesus, all right, and then we should be able to get ourselves quite a nice center like Miles Turner. Yep, we found the trade. Miles Turner in a first. There we go. There's our, there's our starting five right there with Jason Tatum, Brown, Kemba, Grant, and Turner. That's our starting five for this rest of this video, I think. Unless Kemba gets traded because I'm not trading you, you, or you. And then we have Smart, Williams, Naismith, Peyton Pritchard off the bench. JT goes up three overalls. Jalen Brown goes up two overalls. Jeremy Grant goes up one. Miles Turner goes up one. And then, oh, nine for Aaron Naismith. He's an 80 overall now, which is chef kiss. Pritchard, Cervais, Cervais? He could be a decent rotational piece now. Just going to say, stick that out there. Or even a trade asset. Depends on what I need. We've only got the single 
training camp this year. However, we're going to go perimeter defense to Kemba Walker because uh, we need some more perimeter defense. But our starting five, like I said, Kemba, Brown, Tatum, Grant, and Turner. I'm very okay with that. And then we have Marcus Smart, Aaron Naismith, Robert Williams, and Peyton Pritchard off the bench. I am going to be running a nine-man rotation this year. So we might send this guy down the G League with Grant Williams again to see what happens again if we do this. Just to tr see if they can progress some more and then trade him next season, I suppose. We're still running a balanced system. However, it's four and a half stars this season. Is there any other system that's four and a half stars? Nope, just the balanced one. We'll take it. And the Celtics are the projected one seed this year. Hey, this year we got two all-stars. We have ourselves Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum. Beautiful. Whoa. Well, we definitely improved from last season. 62 and 20 was our record. Joel Embiid wins MVP, putting up 32 and 16, as Joel Embiid does. And then Jalen Green, John Wall, Jonathan Isaac, James Wiseman, and Brad Stevens. We finished as a one seed in the Eastern Conference, which is what I would like to see every single season. With JT dropping 28.6, 7.7, and 4.4. And then 23 for Brown and 18 for Kemba, 14 for Grant, 13 for Aaron Naismith. And then Miles Turner came in big with the defense. Offensively, we were the second best team and our defense was the sixth best defense in the league and we were the best differential side in the NBA. So Sim first round here and it's a dub against the Detroit Pistons. Uh, now we got in the second round. Ah, oh, they've changed Hassan Whiteside for Mitchell Robinson. Shit. All right, that's going to be a lot of fun. This is not going to be a fun series, I can tell you. Okay, we won in five games and we're taking on the seven-seeded Hornets who still have LaMelo and they've added Gobert. However, we lose in six games to the Hornets, who end up winning the championship with LaMelo winning finals MVP. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, we're bringing back Naismith, Williams, Pritchard, and all that, because that's basically our entire bench. Uh, qualifying offers, Robert Williams, would you like to come back, my guy? Because you're very handy to have off of our bench with Marcus Smart. You and Marcus Smart are our two powerhouses of the bench, mate. That's... That's what you guys are. Do we have much cap p potential here? No, we don't. We can bring Taco Fall back to Boston. So I'm going to do it. I'm going to bring Taco back just to try and get him an easy ring. Grant Williams goes up four and Davidias goes up three. Three training camps here. We're going to go perimeter defense to Kemba Walker. We're going to go big man defense to Jeremy Grant. And we'll go athleticism to Aaron Naismith. Why not? And our rotation is still almost the exact same. Kemba, Brown, Tatum, Grant, Turner, with Marcus Smart, Naismith, Robert Williams, Surveyus. Hmm. Do we do that? I think we might. We're still running a balanced system. It's still four and a half stars, and we are still projected to be the one seed. Hopefully, we can win this season, please. All stars, we have Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum yet again. We are now going 55 and 27 this time. Luca wins himself MVP. We do get Jason Tatum, all NBA second team, and we do finish as a one seed yet again in the Eastern Conference. JT dropped 30 points a night on seven rebounds and 4.6 assists. 30. All right, well done. Jalen Brown, 26.3, 5 and 4. Then Kemba dropped 21. One, Jeremy Grant dropped 14 and Miles Turner dropped 10. Offensively, we were the second best team and defensively, oh my goodness. We dropped off defensively, lads. We dropped off defensively. We were in the middle of the pack on defense. That's not good at all. That ain't good at all. The Knicks in the first round was an easy win. We now got the Bulls who have added Lonzo. Okay, the Bulls added a ball, brother. Lonzo ball. Uh, but we are... How does that happen then? Just, just, just how does that happen? I don't know how we lost to the Chicago Bulls. How did we do that? Anyone have any answers? Because I don't. I'm, I'm flabbergasted. Well, lads, that is going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. It does mean a lot. We have recently started streaming on Twitch. Link to that should be down in the description below. But be sure to click here if you want to subscribe. Here if you want to watch another video. Go on. I know you want to. Click another video. Do it. Do it right now. Anyway. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you guys all so much for watching and I'll catch us in the next video. Peace.